WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update and currently have all the U.S. indices that we track trading to the upside. Dow's up 228, six tenths percent, one percent for the S&P or 44 points, one and six tenths for the Nasdaq 100, 250 points. The Russell's up one and three tenths. That's a 25 point move. Nearly two percent for the semi, 68 points there. Trend is up over one percent, 193 points. Gold is up 13 dollars. Silver's up a nickel. Lights recruit is off quarter. Natural gas up three pennies. 30-year treasury is up a half a point, trading out at 124.10. Let's go take a look at that nine-panel market update chart. We begin with the ES Mini upper left-hand side. The ES Mini has got resistance at 4609.25. We're trading at 4607 right now. Now, that 4609.25, break that down on your pad of paper. If we close above that, then what will happen is the weekly TD9 count pattern, that'll get negated. The daily Roadsman Dominicator top will get negated, and that will suggest higher price. Higher price going into perhaps mid-August or so. Spot Volatonics yesterday tested and rejected that 50-day exponential moving average at 1474. Markets will not get moving to the downside unless we see that Spot Volatonics above that level. The NQ yesterday had that nice pullback out there, but it was basically just testing its bullish structured daily profile. Now prices above the center line at 15681. I would say if there is a close today on a 30 minute basis above 15829.25, 15829.25 on a 30 minute basis, we'll see you move up to that 15967 level level, maybe even 16062. U.S. dollar index, it does have a A to B equals CD pattern, but I believe that today will become bar number eight of a TD9 count. That says we could have a top in the U.S. dollar index between today and Tuesday. Goldilocks finding support at the bottom of its daily profile yesterday, at the center of its weekly profile. That's in that range of 1984, 1983 to 19, uh, I'm sorry, 1994.90 90 to 19. Jeez, you'd figure I'd get this. 1980-80 to 1983. Woo! Sorry about that. Silver on his pullback yesterday, finding support at the bottom of its weekly profile, 24.15. Light Sweet Crude, it's got an A to B equals CD pattern to the upside, but it has resistance at the top of its weekly profile. So 81.09 is where the sellers reside. Natural gas just consolidating inside its daily profile. And the 30-year Treasury testing its bullish structure daily profile. Did that yesterday. It did that this morning. Therefore, and it has held. Therefore, we've got a consolidation between profile levels 123.15 to 127.24. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Edge Show. We'll have to start your Friday. Have a fantastic one. We'll look forward to seeing you on Monday. Take care now.